News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants. The statewide search for a convicted killer from the valley continues. The search for Gonzalo Lopez now entering day 12. Earlier this month, Lopez busted out of a prison bus in the Centerville, Texas area, and he hasn't been seen since. Authorities are advising people that if they see him to stay away and call 911 immediately. Hidalgo County says they'll no longer be providing daily COVID reports. From now on, they'll be doing two COVID case updates per week. One will be released on Tuesdays and the other on Fridays. Hidalgo County's emergency operational level also dropped yesterday. It went from maximum readiness to escalated operations. Hurricane season starts on June 1st, and today there's going to be a hurricane fair happening at the Brownsville Sports Park. Local, state, and federal agencies will be there to answer questions about securing your pets, protecting important documents, and preparing your home. The fair will be from 4 to 7 p.m. And for our weather today, it was a very wet and stormy night across all of the valley. Rain will continue this morning, but it'll clear out as the day continues. Highs will reach the low 90s. That's your News in 60. Have a great day. News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants.